Hello and welcome back to Learning to Build. Last time we made this beautiful big old cherry tree, custom cherry tree. This time we're just going to make something really simple. I really would like to make like a tulip-esque light, like a street light, a street light that that that's kind of like an upside down tulip. Start the vision off just as as we might want to. Okay, so Hmm, let's yeah, let's just test it in this little gap right here. So we're gonna we're gonna pop some moss down and then a brick wall and then a couple fence blocks, maybe maybe that high. And we're gonna zhuzh this area out a little bit more with some leaves and foliage and stuff. But then we're gonna get to the top here and I think we're gonna wanna come across one maybe. Ooh, but you know what? Maybe we could use a stair here. No, no, I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. I think if we're gonna do this, it needs to come out one further maybe so that we can drop a block from here. Now, obviously we want to go with something as beautiful as a frog light, right? And we could just, should we drop it down one and then put it in? Okay, right now it's looking like those, <laughs> those anglerfish that <laughs> lure in their prey. We don't, we don't. We don't want that. What we want to do is, yeah, let's let's go with cherry for now. And let's see how cherry feels. Just essentially just making it like this. Like a lovely little tulip. It's still looking very anglerfishy. I'm not going to lie. And I think it's because we dropped it down one too low. So let's, let's, <laughs> let's fix that, shall we? And that feels kind of flowery a little bit. We might want to change this out. The nether brick is giving it an odd vibe. Is there something we could hang from there that would look like the middle of a flower? The only thing I can think of that would physically hang from it properly in the way that we would want it to would be obviously the glow berries. We can try that and we could just cheer them. No, that doesn't look right. <laughs> we can't do that. That doesn't look right, does it? No, let's not do that. Oh, oh, okay. What about we could try this? This is an option. That's, you know, potentially dangerous. So maybe we don't do that. What about, what about an end rod? That's not terrible. What about a bell? Does a, would a bell work? The bell's kind of cute. The bell kind of works. We can improve this though. This is improvable. We could have some like little, little drip leaves around at the bottom. Do you see the vibe that I'm going for here? Oh, oh, okay. What, what about a, instead of a bell, what about a spore blossom? Oh, now, now we are cooking babes. Instead of the nether brick, what if we did a combo? of of mud this is an oak moment maybe we should go with some spruce here so let's just whack that one out and then remove those but i feel like it's too plain the way it is there needs to be something else some dimension to it oh what about if we did something like this kind of like it's sprouting that kind of works there's got to be a way to improve it there has to be. Let me just check the stairs won't work in this scenario. I know I, I need to leave the stairs be, but I feel like they, there's, there's scope for them to work. What if we did that? And then that. We could even connect it like that. That has potential for adding in a bit more sturdiness, maybe? Oof, not there. Okay, now hear me out. What if we didn't use the frog light? I know obscene i know babes that is absolutely obscene what if we use the end rod instead and then with this one it's like that's that's what this is what that grows into you know it needs something doesn't it it needs to improve a little bit there maybe maybe this is a trapdoor moment okay what if we make this a slab though oh okay you know, I kind of want to make it taller so that it can drop down onto this. Womp and a womp. I feel like this needs to not be that. This would need to be like that instead, right? And that would make a lovely little enchanted forest style 
lantern, streetlight kind of lamppost. It's magical. You got the spores coming out of this bad boy. You put other flowers around it as well. Put some peonies at the base. And boom, you've got yourself a gorgeous little enchanted forest, have you not? I think what I set out to do today has been achieved. I did manage to make a lovely little flower lamppost. I will be using this personally. I think this is absolutely stunning, babes. Thank you ever so much for watching. You stay fed, you stay watered, you stay rested. Know that you're loved because I love you. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.